hello welcome to this video showing you how to use our pin portal when you log into your account this is the default page it will log you into so the first thing for you to do is to change your login password so when you click on it you see a change password so you enter your default password and enter the new one and uh, save it so that's just a regular way to change your password so the next thing for you to do is to fund your wallet you can see like this sample wallet balance is zero so you need to put money in your wallet so for you to do that you go to wallet funding you see this place wallet funding you click on it there you see add payment account so you click on that button so when you do that it will require you to register the source of your funds where you have your money the place you have your money you want to transfer money out from into our own account so you will register it so that the system can recognize your account so here yeah, you select the bank click on select bank if you have your bank your account with access bank first bank whatever bank you have so you select it here but please note you cannot use access bank under this category so we have another another category called temporary account so i will tell you more about it access bank cannot be used here please take note you can use any other account but not access bank under this category so you select your bank here anywhere you know you have your fund then you put your payment account number the account number where you have your money then by default the system will we scan it and show you your account name then you click on register as payment account so when you do that the system will now show you our own account number as at now you cannot see our account number because we don't want customers to make mistake so that's why we did not put the account number displayed to the general uh, customers so it is only when you have done your part that our account number will be displayed to you for you to go and make payment so you first of all register your account number here then our own account number will be displayed to you for you to not do transfer so if you don't register it you cannot see our account number because we don't want customers to be making mistake that's why we program it this way so the first step is this you come here select the bank where you know you have your money inside your account when you do that you come here and type your account number when you type your account number your 10 digit account number the system will select and show you your account name by default then you click register as payment account as soon as you click on register as payment account our own bank account number will be displayed to you the account where you pay or you do your transfer to from your own account into our own account will be displayed to you then when you do that by default the system will credit your wallet so that is a regular way to fund your wallet so now if you are using access bank and other third party app your category is this one here you see you see access bank app bank uh, pos uh, settings pam pay quick teller carbon open all of these third party app or even pos center you have to generate a temporary account number and that general uh, temporary account number you have to use it to pay just once once in a day so when you click here generate account number the system will give you an account number for you to go and make payment into it and you pay only into that account number just once you cannot pay several times into the account number the system does not allow it one payment per one account so if you want to pay more than once in a day you have to come back and generate a new one so don't store any account number you generate here please so that you don't cause problem for us so that is a simple way i'll take it again if you are using access bank and any of this category of uh, app bank app pos center pam pay quick teller carbon Ope, all of these people here they belong to this category to use temporary accounts so you click here and generate account number 10 digit account number you transfer the money from any source into that account the system will know that you are the owner of that uh, transfer but if you are not using any of this app and you're not using access bank app then you are free to use this side of it all of these options here apart from access bank are good to go if you are making transfer so that is for the payment so when you have funded your wallet your money will be here successfully then you can now go ahead and take a recharge card of your choice your pin you see it so that is just how to go about it so if you want to buy pin look at it buy a pin you click on it and it will come up for you to use 
so what you need to do is just to select the network you want to download so that network will be shown to you mtn glow airtel 9 mobile and we have two types of mtn mtn 10 digits and the regular mtn 17 digits so you have to select one based on the one you want to buy so when the network are displayed to you see it when the networks are displayed to you, you select it this is regular mtn this is the mtn with 10 digit format that's why we label it here this is airtel glow 9 mobile so if you want maybe glow for uh, airtel for instance you come here you select the denomination so the system will show you the denomination you select anything you want here you can say 100 200 500 1000 then the quantity you select the quantity you want 20 40 60 so you have to select any way you want it so you can see that you cannot type manually you cannot type any quantity you have to select one of these options you print one at a time so if you are buying more than this run of it you come back and do it again then you cannot you cannot select buy pin so when you select this buy pin the system will take the money the financial commitment of this transaction from your wallet balance and release the product to you then you come here and click on it there's a link here where you cannot print it so when you come here you click the select network the one you want to print based on what you've selected there you select the format either 40 per page or 60 per page you select how you want the page to come and then here you enter your login password whatever present login password you're using that's what you type here put it for extra security so that nobody can download your file without knowing your password then you now click on print voucher so when you do that your pin will be downloaded in pdf format and you can now print it using your phone or your computer any device you are using to access this our portal so that is the simple way to go about it this place it says watch video guide on how to use the portal so you can watch uh, the video guide from this uh, link i think uh, almost everything you need this one is just your history to see the history about every transaction you are doing this one is just like a link to access all your uh, print voucher uh, history from the one so you get all of those details under this uh, part then everything about wallet funding you find it here query if you want to query your uh, uh, funding like that all of those details all of those details you find it here so it's very straightforward uh, for you to use this uh, portal thanks for your time and have a great day